In tonight's sports, West Indies denied in thrilling chase, upsets at Wimbledon, and Winwood Island Senior Women's Football Championship kicked off. We bowl off tonight's sports shows of World Cup cricket. West Indies fell 23 runs short of a record World Cup run chase, despite a magnificent 118 from Nicholas Puran against Sri Lanka at Chestnut Street. Set 339 after a million century from Sri Lanka's Avishka Fernando, the Windies were 84 for 4 in the 18th over. Puran played some swashbuckling shots, ably supported by Fabian Allen, who scored 51. Yet, with 31 needed from the last three overs, Puran was caught behind as West Indies closed on 315 for 9, Lassif Malinga claiming 3 for 55. Both teams began the match knowing they could not qualify for the semi finals but produced a classic encounter. Up next for the Windies is Afghanistan on Thursday. Onto Wimbledon, top seed Novak Djokovic started his defense of the Wimbledon's men's title by beating Germany's Philipp Kohlschreiber in straight sets as the pair opened up the tournament on center court. Inside the 15,000-seater arena, the 32-year-old Serb was never in serious trouble during a 6-3, 7-5, 6-3 win. Djokovic is aiming for a fifth Wimbledon title and a 16th Grand Slam. Meantime, on the women's side, second seed Naomi Osaka has been dumped out of Wimbledon in the first round, losing 7-6, 6-2 to Yulea Putinseva of Kazakhstan. 15-year-old American qualifier Cory Goff caused a stunning upset by defeating five-time Wimbledon champion Venus Williams in the first round. World number 313 Goff beat Williams, 24 years her senior, at 39-6-4, 6-4. Fellow American Williams had won four Grand Slam titles, including two at Wimbledon, before Goff was born. Women's football now, Winwood Island's senior female football tournament, is scheduled to be held in St. Lucia from the 2nd of July to the 7th of July 2019 at the Darren Sammy Cricket Ground. The tournament kicks off this evening with a doubleheader featuring Grenada versus St. Vincent the Grenadines at 6 p.m., with St. Lucia playing Dominica at 8 p.m. It continues on Thursday, 4th July, with Dominica playing Grenada at 6 p.m. and St. Lucia taking on St. Vincent the Grenadines at 8 p.m. The final round of matches are scheduled for Saturday 6 July with Dominica playing St. Vincent and the Grenadines at 6 p.m. with the curtains descending with Grenada playing St. Lucia at 8 p.m. Grenada are the defending champions. In netball news, a St. Lucia National Netball Association President Mrs. Rufina Paul will be travelling to Liverpool to represent St. Lucia at the International Netball Federation Congress scheduled for 10th to the 11th of July 2019. She will also take the opportunity to attend a special meeting of the America's Federation of Netball Association on July 14th. During her stay in Liverpool, President Paul will be seeking alliances that can benefit netball development in St. Lucia in the short term. Finally, domestic football. Last Sunday, the Marbia Valley Football League commenced its 2019 promotional league at the Grand River playing field with a very entertaining game which resulted in togetherness youth defeating survivors four goals to two. But an Albert scored a brace for survivors, while togetherness youth Nick Mondesi scored a brace as well. Completing the scoring for togetherness youth were Sobi Eugene and Janik Toriel in the 64th and 67th minute respectively. The tournament continues on the weekend. That's the final whistle on tonight's sports.